interrupting my mind that uh, oh. even just 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 I like that just that bit starting by it. Dating a Kenyan girl is not bad. Okay. But now the challenge is okay. the first time when I landed this way okay. I really so beautiful. Today I'm here with also my friend Andrew, and and this particular video we're going to talk about dating in Kenya. So Andrew is from Uganda, so we're going to ask him as a Ugandan, how does he feel like dating in Kenya and Ghana? So Andrew, what's your man? How uh, like how's your first experience like you date a Kenyan girl? Oh uh, yeah, Th um, uh, thanks Mr. Ab uh, Fahan for giving me the chance uh, to again talk to the media. Yeah, dating a Kenyan girl is not bad, okay. but now the challenge is, okay. the first time when I landed this way, okay. I really saw beautiful girls. Okay. You know, for me, I'm a person who likes the behind parts, <laughs> so whenever I could reach, you know, when I'm moving, okay. I could look behind, okay. I see people moving with very big booms, I said, wow. What is this? Okay. I even felt like just moving, you know, <laughs> following them wherever they go. Okay. But now let me tell you the challenge is. Yeah. This way, yeah. you know for me I'm a person who likes speaking English okay. just because it is our language in you, in yeah. Uganda, yeah, okay? Yeah, yeah. Not like a, here in Kenya that they speak Swahili. Okay. So when, whoever girl that I could go to, okay. totally, yeah. English is a problem. Yeah, they, they also speak Swahili. They also speak Swahili, yeah, yeah. of which I don't know Kiswahi, okay. Swahili. Okay. And yet it is the first time for us to, for me to arrive here, okay? okay? So, yeah. you, know, you know, for me when I, when I arrived, when I just arrived like this, yeah. the, the blood began moving. Okay. I could not settle in the same place, eh? Okay. So within one, two, three days, I got somebody that I can date, yeah. that I can date. Okay. But now on reaching there, the girl, the girl could not know even how to speak uh, English. Uh, English. Okay. She could not know even how to how to hug somebody she's just they just tell you that oh for me they are tough they are what okay. so I was confused mm -hmm. I even lost the interest okay. it is until after some time okay. that I had to realize that when you keep moving when you keep searching mm -hmm. there are some who, who okay. know something so if was like, like question, eh? how long like does it take you to, to speak Israeli when, when you come to Kenya you know the language of which you have never went to class and even had A B C. Okay. It took me some time. Okay. But just because I'm I'm also a stubborn boy, I could speak some you know okay. broken broken Swahili like that. So within one month, okay. I had mastered how to greet, how to how to borrow something, how okay. to speak some little little things. But now it took me some time, around three months. Okay. That's when I had to master speaking something uh, something to somebody. Okay. Yeah. So like after you learned Swahili. Like, uh, like, was it for you like today? A Kenyan girl? Yeah, it was useful for me just because whenever I could go to a lady, interrupting my mind that uh, oh. even just, 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 I like that just that beat starting by it. Do you believe in love? How crazy it could be, okay. baby, baby, stop. Mm. Mm. Take it easy. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pull up, pull up. Pin up, pin up, pin up, pin up. So, so if, like, uh, if I ask you, like, uh, like when, you, when you become a musician, like, what was your challenge? Like, do you have like, any challenge? Uh, I dislike any challenge because even uh, I want to challenge someone. Yeah. I, I hate this one saying that uh, change will change you. I, I, I can accept. I can accept the thing that I can change, but she will not change me. So I will not be defeated by someone, but I can I can defeat those ones. Okay. The girls that they are all okay. among uh, artists, okay. but I can come from there. Yeah. So you guys, uh, this is a new artist. Uh, actually, I told you like he has been in the industry for many years. So you guys you have to support him. He's our brother. You have to show him some love. So it, it feels like uh, like. Like what's your plan like next? Like do you have like any music which is coming out now? I have a plan. Okay. Uh, like uh, I have a plan. Okay. That plan is on the way. Okay. Even I have them. It's like when you can, I can sit down, okay. I can write a song. Okay. And then I practice. Okay. But I need a support. Okay. Yeah. I need a support. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 
I'm underground, dancing, all the kind of beats are under the music industry. I'm under there. Okay, so uh, uh, what is your message to the world? Like, as a being like a new artist, like, what's your message to the world? Because there are so many young talented uh, artists, but they don't have a chance to like, like, uh, like come out, like, <coughs> doing all their things. Yeah. Uh, my chance that you. Uh, Kale, those artists, okay. I want to be like, like that artist called the. It's called who? Comes from Tanzania. Yeah. Uh, diamond Plat Platinum. Not Diamond Platinum. Okay. This is. Uh, he's called the. Uh, how do you call this man? Mm. A little bit, I'm sorry. This called the called. Uh, who sing that song that that uh, Beleko? Oh, okay. Something, uh, something to somebody. Okay. Yeah. So like after you don't so anything. Like, uh, like, was it useful for you, like, to a king and Yeah, it was useful for me just because mm -hmm. whenever I could go to a lady, okay. yeah, and then I talk to a, a girl, just greet, I okay. say something small. Okay. At least we, I could be able to speak with somebody because they had to pick some sense in me. Okay. Uh, not like the first one I spoke English. Okay. You know, by the first one I used to speak English, okay. no girl liked me okay. just because they thought that maybe I'm fooling them. Okay. But when I came to know English, uh, Kiswahili, okay. it helped me up to the extent of even dating many, not one. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, so like my second question, yeah. Hmm. Is Kenyan girls like approachable? Like, is it easy for, for someone like you, like, to, to approach Kenyan girls? Okay. Now that is, uh, it depends. Eh? Okay. You know. Okay. Uh, they always say that love is blind. Okay. But to a certain extent, it's not blind. You know, when you love a girl, maybe you are from Uganda and you have ever dated somebody there, <laughs> then it becomes difficult for someone else whom you have just found to change your life. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm. So like, uh, like, it's, it's your, like, like for your experience, yeah. Mm. Can you compare and Kenyan ladies to, to Uganda ladies? Like, and what is the difference between the, the, the two? Yeah. Oh, the difference between the man, let me tell you. Okay. For Ugandan ladies are very hot. Okay. They know how to do things. Eh? Okay. Not like this way, just because <laughs> for this way, yeah, people are just kept, uh, kept in the doors. Okay. They actually don't know love, even if they are beautiful, but they don't know love. They are not like Ugandan girls. Okay. That's what I can assure you. Okay. Uh, for Ugandan girls are sharp, and then they can show you something. You really see somebody has shown me, and then you follow. Okay. Yeah. So like. Uh, is it true that some people say that Kenyan girls, they, they love money? Is that true? Now it depends on the tribe that you have landed on. Eh? Okay. Now if you land on the tribe like some Kikuyu girls, <laughs> then they, it means that they are going to eat. <laughs> yeah, and you remain nothing. Eh? Yeah, so okay. it depends on the tribe that you have landed on. Okay, yeah. 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 Thank you very, very much, man. Okay, guys, please subscribe to the channel. Please. Yeah, this is Andrew. Yeah, thanks so much. Thanks for watching. I like you so much. For, thank you for being my friend. Uh, so, so let me ask you more. How was your first impression when you came to Kenya first time? My first impression to come to Kenya it was uh, anywhere. It was being being an artist. Uh, okay. So, like, how did you feel like, like when you first landed to Kenya? Like, what was your? It will be great. Okay. Mm. So, is there things that you like about Kenya? I like so much and I prefer them okay. other than Uganda. Okay. Mm. So, how is dating in Kenya? Have you ever dated a Kenyan lady? I've ever been, I've ever dated a Kenyan guy. Though the girls that they are sweet, but they are not so sweet. Okay. Why? 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 Uh, they are not sweet because that they are not. They doesn't show any love. Okay. They, they just know little love, but if you get your Someone who knows who love you, who promises everything that you can make it. Okay. okay. Yeah. So, can someone you... tells that loves you in this, in deep peace, in a love you independence, yeah. it's very good. Okay. So, so like, can you compare like Kenyan ladies to <coughs> Ugandan ladies? I can compare. Okay. To compare a Ugandan lady and a Kenyan lady okay. is that a Ugandan lady, she knows her emotion is either positive or negative, but a Kenyan doesn't know either her emotion are positive. A negative or positive. And this is artist from one that's called Elvis. Can you show him some love? This keeps Ivan Peter. Ah. Mm. Yeah.